Hey everyone, welcome back to Terra Mater Garden. On today's episode of Edible Weeds, we're featuring a plant you might know for its playful birds that clean the clothes and fur, burdock. Don't be fooled by its clinging tactics, beneath that its spiky exterior lies a delicious and versatile friend waiting to be discovered. Burdock boasts a global presence. This spiky green giant has been a traveler for millennia, following humans across continents and even popping up in historical contexts from ancient Rome to Japan. Interestingly, Burdock even has a historical nickname, Beggar's Buttons, referencing its famous clinging burrs. So how did this historical traveler become a garden nuisance for some? Burdock thrives in disturbed soil and loves full sun, making it a common sight in wastelands, roadsides, and even neglected gardens. Its large size and persistence taproot make it a competitor for resources in cultivated areas, but for the forager, burdock is readily available bounty. You'll find burdock popping up in sunny areas with disturbed soil like fields, roadsides, and even vacant lots. Look for tall plants with large heart-shaped leaves and distinctive purple flower heads that turn into those infamous burrs in the fall. Focus on young plants for the best flavor and texture before the burrs develop. Before you harvest your burdock, there's one crucial tip, handle with care. Burdock's leaves and stems have tiny spines that can irritate your skin. Wear gloves when harvesting and focus on the younger, smoother parts of the plant. Also avoid harvesting from areas treated with herbicides or pesticides. Once you've identified and harvested your burdock safely, it's time to explore its culinary potential. Burdock boasts a surprisingly mild, slightly earthy flavor that shines in various dishes. Young leaves and stems can be enjoyed peeled, chopped, and stir-fried for a delicious side dish. Burdock root is the true star. When peeled and chopped, it can be roasted, stir-fried, or even used for substitute for potatoes and stews and soups. The key to enjoying burdock lies in proper preparation. Older leaves and stems can be tough and stringy, so focus on young, tender parts. Burdock root requires peeling to remove the tough outer layer. Once cooked, it develops a delightful, slightly sweet, and earthy flavor with a satisfying, chewy texture. Burdock isn't just tasty, it boasts a surprising amount of nutrition. These spiky green giants are a good source of fiber, prebiotics, and inulin, which can aid digestion. Some historical uses even suggest burdock may have detoxifying properties. Burdock's benefits extend beyond the kitchen. The roots and leaves have been used historically for medicinal purposes in various cultures, and some studies suggest it may have anti-inflammatory properties. Burdock oil is also used in some cosmetic products. Burdock is a testament to the hidden potential of plants often dismissed as weeds. With a little knowledge and the right approach, even a spiking nuisance can be transformed into a delicious, nutritious addition to your diet. So the next time you encounter a patch of burdock, don't see it as a pest. Remember, when proper identification, preparation, and some caution around the spiky bits, this forgotten giant offers a delightful culinary adventure and boost of nutrition and a connection to historical traditions. Remember, with a little knowledge and the right approach, even a common weed can become a delicious and enriching addition to your life. If you enjoyed learning about burdock, be sure to subscribe for more episodes of Edible Weeds. We'll be uncovering the secrets of other underappreciated forage greens, so stay tuned for exciting discoveries in the wild world of edible plants. Happy foraging, but forage safely.